everyone, it's Amy from Infinity Personal Training and today we're going to make chicken lettuce wraps. Um, if you're like me, I used to love to go to P.F. Chang's and get their lettuce wraps, um, but if I looked at the ingredients, they're not the best, so we're going to make our own version. So first, I'm going to go through their ingredients. There are a lot of ingredients, but it makes it taste delicious. So um, first, we're going to need one pound of chicken and we're going to heat that in a tablespoon of sesame oil. That's going to give it that Asian-y flavor. So we're going to do that first. Okay, so the chicken is almost cooked. We're going to add in a couple of more ingredients and we're going to get those cooking as well. So we have five ounces of shiitake mushrooms. We're going to throw those in. Then we have, I don't remember how many scallions I'll post <laughs> on the side, but we're going to throw those in. Or green onions, those are the same. Then this is coconut aminos. We're using a tablespoon of that. And we have a tablespoon of grated ginger. We're going to throw that in there and we're going to mix it all in. We basically want to cook this until the, um, the onions are, go a little limp and the mushrooms are cooked. So the chicken is still cooking and we're just going to, I'm going to go through the rest of their ingredients um, because they're kind of long. So first we have five cloves of garlic cut up. Then we have um, a half a, uh, one fourth a cup of almonds. I got the slivered ones so they would be easier to chop. You don't have necessarily have to do that. Um, then we have sriracha. This is spicy sauce. Um, it's going to give it a little bit of a kick. Um, I got Organicville brand. This does have sugar in it, but I looked at all the other brands and they all had corn syrup or um, non-organic cane sugar so this was a better option and since you're only using a little bit it's okay then we're gonna use Dijon mustard we're putting a teaspoon of that and we're using that raw honey again and we're putting a tablespoon of this and last we have um, white wine vinegar so this is the brand that I use I got that at Whole Foods and we're gonna put one fourth a teaspoon of sea salt we have pink Himalayan. So I'm going to dump all that in to our mixture. There's that. And the chicken is cooked. So now we're just making it taste good. Put a tablespoon. And this actually calls for raw honey this time. I don't know how I'm going to. Do that. Ah, this raw honey, man, it gives me problems every time. Use your fingers if you're making it for your family. They don't care. Body <laughs> Ray's gonna eat it regardless. I don't have that problem in my household. Put the Dijon mustard. I'll put a little bit more because it got stuck. Then we're going to put this in there. We're going to put a tablespoon of the sriracha. I'm going to put a little bit more because I used the same thing that I used the honey for. So I got a little stuck. And this smells delicious. Can't smell it, but I'm very excited. It could also be that I'm very hungry. All right, so just gonna make sure that's all incorporated. And the last thing we're gonna add is the salt. I'm actually gonna taste it first. Um, I can't take the salt out, so if I don't, I don't want it to make it too salty. It actually tastes good like that. I don't think I'm gonna put the salt in there. I'm actually gonna leave the salt out. It's up to you if you want to put extra salt that's your call um, but I tasted it and it didn't need salt it tastes really good um, the coconut Ray reminded me that I didn't explain what coconut aminos is um, coconut aminos is a substitute for soy sauce 
It's made from coconuts. Um, you know how we feel about soy. That's a whole nother video. But <laughs> you can find coconut aminos and um, it's made by Coconut Secrets and you can find that at Whole Foods. So this is all done. So I'm just going to come on over here and okay, finish. So our chicken wraps are all done. Um, lastly, all I'm going to do is take lettuce wraps. Just I use um, the iceberg lettuce. You just cut the core out of it and then you have big lettuce wraps. You can pretty much use any lettuce. doesn't really matter. Or you can mix this into a salad. You could have it on the side with broccoli. Whatever floats your boat. But there we go. PF Chain knockoff lettuce wraps. That's it.